Hi, it's Kathy Ann Lewis, and here's your faith lift for the day. And I want to start out with a little parable. I heard this many, many, many years ago, and it's still really a, a powerful a parable. There was, there was a seeker, and he found a guru. And he went to the guru and he said, oh, beloved guru, oh, master of life, tell me the meaning of life, the meaning of life. And the guru said, attention. Oh, yeah. Okay. Got it. Got it. Well, tell me, tell me the real meaning of life. Attention. Attention. No, I got it. But what's deeper? There's got to be something deeper. <laughs> and the guru said, attention, 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 attention. It's a way of describing the law of cause and effect. And the law of cause and effect is what uh, people are talking about, but they're not talking about it. So when you see things on social media about manifestation, and when you see things on, on social media about you can go from this much money to this much money, they're actually talking about the law of cause and effect. They're talking about how to use the law of cause and effect. But the law of cause and effect is consciousness, what we have going on in here all the time, is cause. And what we see is effect. So I want to give you a really easy technique to to use the law of cause and effect for your benefit because we're always using it. We're always using it. We can't not use it unless I guess we're in a coma and maybe then even then we're using it. I don't know. I I've never been in a coma, so I can't I can't say for sure. But I do know that when I'm conscious of the law of cause and effect, I consciously create the effects that I want. And here's one of the simple ways that I do it. And that is through the law of attention. Attention, attention, attention. What you give your attention to, attention to increases. It happens with the body. Yeah, I, I notice people start to get ill and then they, they pay more attention to the illness. And, and then they wait for the next thing to be bad or whatever, instead of appreciating the health that they have. I've watched people have miracles in their life, even though they're going through a physical challenge by acknowledging the challenge, but also paying attention to the health that their body has. See, a lot of times we don't pay attention to our health. We don't pay attention to our body unless it starts to suffer or feel bad or, or not function well. Pay attention to the health of your body. The same thing with money. A lot of times we don't pay attention to this thing called money unless we have huge bills or something that we need to pay right away or, or we want to go on a trip but we don't have the money. We seem to pay attention to money when there's a problem. Pay attention to money when things are good. Love that paycheck. Pay attention to your savings account. Start another savings account. Pay attention to how much you can put away um, to save up for a vacation. Pay attention to your budget. I mean, some people just go unconscious. That's not helpful. It's not helpful. Pay attention. Pay attention to what you love about the people you love. We can get so used to people that we start to nitpick them. I don't like this and I don't like that. That's, that's, that's a death spiral for relationships. Death spiral. Just not, not be, turn a blind eye to what you don't like, but make sure that you, you might not like them. I don't know, I'm going to make something up. Leaving towels on the floor. And that's okay. Because we all have habits that we could probably, you know, improve on. But make sure that you say, oh, wow, I really appreciate that you cleared the table. I really appreciate that you did the bills. I really appreciate that you thought of me today and gave me a call. See, what are we paying attention to? What we pay attention to increases. That could be your mantra. I pay attention. I pay attention. I pay attention. I'm creating the life. I will love to live. All right. So your assignment for the week is to start paying attention and pay attention to what you pay attention to. <laughs> and then pay attention to what you want to see more of. Bye for now.